What's up guys, it's Claudio and I'm back to racing. Let's go, it's Thursdays with Claudio. All right guys, listen, <clears throat> it's, um, wow, this is uh, it's my first time back racing this season. It's my first set of races. There are four races in this video. They're all really exciting, really fast. Like a Santa Velodrome. Uh, we're starting off with a five lab scratch. Five laps, it's a fast race. There he goes, the first attack. Phil, the sprinter, I don't know where he got the guts to do this. Nobody does this. He's a sprinter and he's going for it five laps in. I mean, it's like a three minute effort that he has to do. Uh, it's very intense. And we're gonna talk all about this, um, all kinds of things in this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm happy to be back. Look at him, there he is. He's got a gap and we gotta chase him down. Guys, track is so exciting. It's like the last lap of a criterium. You know, it, it, it's the last three minutes. These races, they're so short. They're so exciting. All about positioning, all about um, conserving and being, uh, it's, it's extremely strategic. And I'm trying to stay out of the wind. I, I really don't know. I was really nervous here because I didn't know where I was in terms of my fitness. It's my first time out there. And I have to say, um, okay, there's Phil. Wow, he's got a gap on us. I have to say I had some legs, but I didn't have uh, the top end. Cause you know, I was off structured training for six weeks because I was sick. By the way, I caught another cold at this race. It's so annoying. Um, I'm off the bike right now for four days. <clears throat> Anyways, Phil's got a huge gap and I'm like, nope, I'm not pulling through, sorry. Um, I'm definitely not the strongest or the fastest in this group. There's enough, uh, there are enough Watts in this group to, to pull him back. I'm not doing anything. Also, I'm very insecure about my fitness at this first race. I'm testing everything out. Wow, Phil's really out there. And we're gonna start to pick it up. Um, so I was off structured training for six weeks. I'm just building it back. So I, was, I felt ready to at least hang in there with the guys. This is the Cat 4 at Casena, and it's a, it's a whole Omnium situation. So it's six days and we are, uh, did we catch him? We're going for points. There's four flights, uh, or there's three flights plus a feature. There he is. Uh, we're bringing him back. Going 27 miles an hour. I got a 52-15 uh, gear ratio. <coughs> That's what I used last year. Um, and here comes Simon. And uh, that's his teammate. There's no real team. It's not a team uh, effort, but teams do stuff here. You can't sleep on that. Is this, is this it? Oh my God, that was it, that was final lap. And there goes the podium. I think Phil got caught by the one guy. Anyways, that was really short guys. That's a five lap scratch. Uh, now we're into the nine lap points. Okay, I was out of position, but I felt okay there. Um, I just don't have the top end. Okay, nine lap points. A points race is when uh, so you have nine laps and there are three sprints throughout the race and you got to try to win the sprints because you get the most points And if you're at this race or if you know how, how it scores, I always forget how it scores uh, Leave it in the comments. Remind me how it scored. It's like five four three So there's three sprints. The, there's gonna be a sprint in about two laps the first sprint Your goal is to get in the top three of those sprints. Maybe the top four get points and you rack up all the points and whoever has most points in that race wins that race, right? And so it's very strategic because some people go for the first sprint um, and then they burn themselves out and then they drop off, but they get a bunch of points. Uh, some people go for the second round of sprints, which means that you have to, which is usually what I like to do, but you have to stay in the race because that first sprint is going to split the group. So you got to do an effort anyways, just to stay in it. It's so annoying. This is like a hurt fest. It's, um, it, it, it really is it, hard. It, it, this race has, has always been hard for me. We have seven laps. I think we have one more. Okay, this is coming up on the sprint, the first sprint. And there they go. They're going for it. The big guys and the sprinters trying to get in there. <clears throat> I'm not going for it because I'm, honestly, I'm probably kind of hurting already. Or I, I was, I was very, um, I was very passive here and this whole day because I didn't know the depth of my fitness And here they go. I think oh, yeah fourth place also gets points. So here pink rhino Matt got some points 
No, it's very good. So now, look at the split. Look, look how it's all strung out. And some people are just falling off completely. <coughs> but here comes a second wave of the people that were, that are thinking about going for the second uh, round of points. You can get a lot of points. So, um, and also the people that sprinted up there, they want to stay awake to get more points. If, if you're really strong, you can totally do that. Oh my God. <coughs> my voice guys please subscribe if you haven't subscribed I've got more videos Thursdays with Claudio I know it's Friday um, but I, I'm putting out this videos I've got so much stuff going on this this season it's gonna be so great subscribe smash the like button notifications the whole thing <coughs> man I'm so annoyed that I caught this cold it was chilly that day and I was out there just on the lawn the whole time it was kind of windy oh there was a, there was a gnarly headwind not on this section this is tailwind right here forgot to mention this let's see what the left counter we got for okay i think that was a sprint right there <clears throat> it looks like it so missed out on the second round now we're going into the headwind the headwind was really hard i mean we're talking 15 20 miles an hour it was nuts maybe more i'm eating a lot of wind i can't do this <clears throat> I need to catch up. Come on, Claudia, let's go. My RPMs are looking okay. I wonder if I can go up. <clears throat> I actually, um, I got a 53 today in the mail. A 53 tooth front chain. It's gonna bump me up. It's gonna give me a little bit more speed on the top end so I don't spin out so much. But I'm not sprinting right now, so I'm not really spinning out yet. Um, and and I, I have been working out, guys. You know, if you follow me on Instagram, Claudio underscore Fior, you've seen my strength routine. Oh, I'm, I'm really like out of it. Yeah, I'm totally out of it here. So I've been lifting, I've been squatting. Um, I should be able to push a little bit heavier gear here and get into the 96 ratios. 96, I'm running a 94, uh, 93 and a half, 94. And I'm basically, unless we bridge right now, <coughs> which is um, actually what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to jump, sorry, um, David, I, I jumped him. It wasn't very nice, but we were running out of time. I can't, we can't do like, uh, we can't do like, uh, you know, helping each other, rotating. I just want to bridge real f quick because there's one lap to go. Um, so I had to put that effort in and do I make it? Do I gain contact? This is Bell Lap, but guys, I'm toasted. I do, I regain contact, but here we go. Uh, they're just going to take off and forget it. I'm donezo. And that's it, guys. I got zero points in this race. I was, uh, again, you have to be aggressive. You have to be strategic. You got to you gotta get up there. Um, you, I, I've done well in points races, but I, I was really fit when I, when I did that. And I was up there. I was, like, in the top three. I was always, like, vigilant. Um, <clears throat> four lab scratch. This is uh this is a short race, man. Each lap is like less than 30 seconds. Let's think about that. All right, two minute race is what we have here. <clears throat> they shortened it because of, um, it was supposed to be longer. They shortened it because it was taking so long, all the different races. Like you're here all day. You're here for four or five hours, really. Because there's so many flights. You have the category four, fives, of two different category fives. We have the women's, the women's A's and the B's, and then we have the, it's a whole thing, the one, two, threes. And here we go, another scratch race. Scratch races are um, all about just whoever finishes first, that's it. And there's so many different ways to finish a race, right? Um, and I'm really staying out of the way. I gotta hide, 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 hide. My my threshold is around 255, 56 right now. It's fine to hang on, but here this is this is all just like really all about sprinting and recovering, big efforts and recovering, because you have to do several efforts every race. Um, this short of a race, you really just need one effort. <clears throat> just one is enough, okay? And it's gonna be, uh, and here goes Simon, oh my God. So that's his effort. And he's gone. I cannot do that. It's, this is headwind, so it's insane. 
now we step on it and uh, everybody's uh it's like two laps to go here maybe this is bell lap let's take a look at the counter what is what do we have yeah it looks like two laps um we gotta go come on claudio let's go push some watts here comes the headwind but you gotta stay sheltered get in the sprinter's lane this red line here to the left that's the sprinter's lane nobody can pass you uh, on the inside there, if you're under that red line, you're protected. Uh, you got to pass on the right. So, and it's the shortest, like this guy is passing me, right? Um, actually, that was it. Oh, my God. That was it. I got zero points. You saw Simon's move? That was the move. He went for it. He got, I don't know what he, he probably got top three for sure. I don't know if somebody else ran at him at the end. Um, but that was one effort. All you need is one big calculated effort, and you got it. Seven lab scratch. This is the feature. So after all the flights, there's a feature. And so everybody's in here. All the guys from uh, the A field, the, the one, two, threes, and the the fours and the fives, they, they can race here. Um, and so I was, we were in there with the one, two, threes. There were some one, two, threes in here. Heavy hitters. And I'm in there just having a good old time. Seven, seven laps go fast, but there's time to maneuver, position, attack, recover, attack, recover. So it takes some fitness. We got some attacks here. And so we got time to bring it back, right? Nobody's panicking. That's what's going on here in seven laps. We got time. I'm sheltered. I'm trying to hold wheels. The thing about being more up track is you're doing more distance, right? You always got to remember in the longer races, you know, it, it gives you an out because you can go around. It gives you more options. Uh, you don't get boxed in, but you're doing more distance. So instead of doing 400 meters, I'm doing like 450 meters a lap or 500 meters per lap. So we got to think about that. We don't notice it when it's happening. But it, it puts a, it, you know, it puts a dent in your legs. So always be aware of how far up the track you are, because <coughs> it's gonna catch up with you. The longer the race, the longer it is. Uh, the more effort you're gonna put in if you're up there. So now, I'm, now I'm back at around the 400 meter in the sprinter lanes. You're doing 400 meters. Oh, we gotta go around. Let's go. We're moving. Oh, this is bad. I'm in the headwind. And I gotta close it. I gotta close this gap. People are falling back. And we got a bridge. There's a front group. Now there's a split. And this I knew this was gonna happen because you know the the difference in fitness here is big in this feature. And now I'm catching, I gotta catch a wheel, I gotta catch a ride back. Let's go. Here it is. This is a move. This is perfect. I'm gonna get in the draft, and I am uh, he's gonna bridge me back up. Boom. All right, contact. Recover. We're halfway through the race. We got one, one or two more efforts left. <clears throat> and this is, um, this is where strategy really comes in. You see, how many matches have you burnt already? How many matches have, have the, the other riders burnt? Start taking the tally. We have a team here. The team in blue, Lina. You're not supposed to do team stuff. It's like a weird gray area. I don't even understand it. <coughs> it's not really a team race. But of course, they're they're you know, they they're doing stuff. Of course they are. And what I mean by that is that somebody goes up the front and they're not chasing. Like the teammate is not going to bridge to them right they're not gonna do work they're gonna they're just gonna let a gap open and then you have to go around so that's kind of like the the extent of the team tactics that happen here what, what does it say oh, I can't even read it we've got a couple laps left and so um, it gets um you got to be aware of it because the teammates are not gonna chase each other down and like this right here right there's a teammate up there and now we got to go around Simon but I'm just gonna stay on his wheel because I don't want to do a huge effort, and he's already, you know, picking up the pace. And now his teammate is up at the front, and now Simon's going to go. You see that? You see how that works? 
And now Phil here is not doing anything. We got two laps to go. So that's like Team 101 stuff, and you gotta be aware of it. Now Simon's way up there. Phil's not chasing, but he's just gonna get a free ride up there. And I am, I'm being way too passive. Come on. Uh, do more stuff, Claudio. <laughs> be more exciting. <coughs> I have, um, again, I didn't know the depth of my fitness. I was okay, I could have done more. There it is, bell lap, one lap to go. And all the sprinters are in position, they're up there. And, um, oh, here comes another sprinter. They're all going for it, we're, we're, we're back together. I'm dying. <laughs> I'm already barely, I don't know how I made it uh, to this part of the race. And there they go, they're, there's the top three sprinters up there. And there goes the podium, I don't know what I finished, whatever. But man, I had a great time. Guys, this is Kisena. There's six days. Um, I'm so excited to be a part of uh, this race scene and um, there's gonna be a lot more videos. Please stay tuned, subscribe, follow me on Instagram for all my updates and I'll see you guys out there. Peace. Oh, I cried last